Okay, welcome part two of my tour into Fox DM below the collection. Real quickly, I will show you the bonus features of the King Eye. There's a lot on here. Now I'll show you the Life of Pi special features. This is also a 3D Blu-ray. Do not get the regular Blu-ray, unfortunately. But it's okay. I don't really collect. I don't really collect Blu-ray 3Ds. As far as I know. I'm gonna put the uh, Dawn Dinosaurs DVD back in. It was a it's bonus disc. This set is pretty cool. I have not watched I Say Dawn Dinosaurs on DVD. I need to watch this film again. See how it is. Here's Molly and Me, the tourist bad dog edition. It's a it's a very good movie. It's funny and it's um, romantic. I'm not sure. I probably don't think it's a romantic in my opinion. But, yeah. Disc, disc 1 is the DVD copy which has a lot of special features on here. Well, not that much a lot of special features, I meant to say. And the deal copies here. Try use it already, don't worry. Here's Missile Goings, one from Poem. It's full screen edition. Do not get the wide screen edition though, but it's okay. It's still good to have. Get special features on here. And the blue and fortunately a heel is not pretty good. Because there are no bonus features. You can you have to get the DVD edition because it has bonus features on here. Don't get the Blu-ray edition because there's no bonus features. It's the point in dynamite. It's a funny movie. Makes me laugh. Some parts, I think. Ugh. Flippin' features. <laughs> yeah. I enjoyed the heck of this movie. It's not in the museum. It's not that many features on here. No blinds in featurettes or anything. In fact... I think I do need to get the two disc DVD someday with bonus features on here. Here's 90 Museum about Smithsonian. I unfortunately don't have this film on the iTunes anymore, but it's okay. It's Oklahoma. It's a good movie. The page master. This is the film that I seen when I was a kid. And I like it back. And I liked it. I need to watch this movie again soon. Here's Rio. Good movie. I enjoyed it. Has and has only just the eyes of George Lopez and Jamie Fox. His robots, the deal copy edition. Nate. So the DVD is actually from turn 5, but there's a deal copy edition in here. And this is interesting because the deal copy code is actually inside the case. 
when you take the dual cup, uh, I'm not going to take the dual copy out. The code's expired. I only used it, by the way. It's a good movie. Here's the Guavo to me. And this. And uh, I seen this movie with. I saw this movie in the theaters of my school, and it's a very good movie. Here. It's very romantic and very funny. See, so cool. Says the description says life is about courage and going into the unknown. And you see, you actually take out the sub color here, and it does show special features which I'll point them out to you. And this some uh, Blu-ray is really, and uh, this Blu-ray is actually really good. Because this, it has iTunes, but at this time, you can go to Fox Redeem and download it from iTunes. So I'm pretty glad Fox did this to this Blu-ray. Very good job. I used it, by the way, so I'm covering it my fingers so you won't steal it. The Soko is hard to get back in. So I'm gonna put the camera down so I can get this some uh, back in. Thing is, you have to put the case back in Soko like this, but not down here like this because it's hard to get out. Ugh. This is the most. The subcover is hot. Yeah, they did a pretty bad job with the subcover, but they did a good job with the blue way. Good to know the vacuum noise. Track the musical. The toy will only bother musical. I do like musicals, of course. I'm gonna watch. I got this for my birthday last year. It's a big bad hit. Yeah. Does have iTunes zero copy. This will up some scene the Broadway musical one, Blue Way. Here's Skyfall, a Gene Bond movie. I do have Bond the uh, 50. But I will not include this because it's a box set that's bigger than, much thinner like this. Suko's nice. It's not embossed or anything, but still good. I tend to copy. This is the only MGM film that I got that I have. It has deal. I tend to copy. Hmm. It's sound music. It's a great film. One of my one of my all time favorite movie musicals. Here's all of Truth. These are Stargate films. My mom loves Stargate Atlantis. Season 3. Back season 1 is so many pictures. I'm not sure what the second season is. Oh. Got something. Pictures. Season 4. Um, I'm busy, mom. 
Okay. Sorry about that. Here's a born. I mean, Stargate Coliseum, my bad. I probably will watch I probably will watch the TV series someday. If I get a chance. And here are the Star Wars films, and I am a fan of Star Wars, of course. Here's episode one, the Phantom Menace. Here, here's Star Wars episode two, Attack, Attack Clones. And this is the only Star Wars movie that I have, which, actually, which is actually full screen. I did not get the widescreen edition. That's odd. Hmm. I I couldn't find the widescreen edition, but they didn't have it, so I ended up getting the full screen edition. The rest of the Star Wars movies I have are widescreen. Here's episode three. Avengers you said this is the widescreen edition. And here are the original trilogy. I used to have the box set, but. I used to have the box for the four films, but not any four DVDs, but not anymore. Here's Star Wars Episode 4, A New Hope. Great film. Here's Impulse Right Back. My favorite Star Wars movie. And a lot of people's favorite as well. Here's Episode 6, Return of the Jedi. And the bonus material. I'm going to open this up quickly. The, the disc is in. The, um, the disc is in my uh, computer. But not interested in showing discs for you. But these are special features which I will point them out to you. Here's Turbo. I haven't seen this one yet, but I will check it out someday. Guys at Costco. This year. January 2014. False Grumman 3 Amazing Adventures. This is the Hero Entertainment DVD that's distributed by 22 Fox. Which Hero Entertainment now distributed Lionsgate. Is distributed by Lionsgate. Here's Welcome to Mooseport. Boy Side Story. It's a great film. And finally, the two X Men films I have. Here's X2 X Men United. I don't have the first film, but I will look for it someday. It's a two X set. You know. And X Men 3 The Last Stand. This one I hear is not good. It got bad reviews when it came out. Ugh. This sequel's okay. It's not good at all for me. But X2 is good. As well as the first film. And first class I hear is excellent. The Wolverine? No. Uh, X-Men Origins Wolverine. The actual film, The Wolverine from 2013, looks good, but I will check it out someday. Okay. See you in my next video. Bye.